how to create a carousel post on a facebook business page hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial today i am going to show you how you can create your own carousel post using facebook ads manager here we are on the facebook ads manager all you have to do is you click on start now and it will be guiding you to the campaigns that you have created to be able to create the cursor post, all you have to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you will be good to go. Right here I have this account. It is a account created for the sake of the video. It is not a account used for any personal uses. Now let's go ahead and create the carousel post. Now we are on the campaigns of Facebook ads. I am going to click on create right here. I am going to choose, um, for example, an engagement or a, a sales for the uh, carousel post. I am going to the engagement as an objective. Now I am going to the recommended settings. This is the second part. The campaign name, I am going to name it Carousel, Carousel, like this, and or with one R. Uh, here we have the A, B slash, uh, B, A slash B test. It is, uh, I will turn it off or let it off. For the advantage campaign budget, I will let it off also. I'm going to click on next. Here is the conversion location. Here we have the messaging app on your ad. Here I will let it on your ad. We have calls, websites, Facebook page, and etc. Now for the ad set name, I am going to put it here Carousel also. Carousel. Carousel. And let it here. Now for the next step, the engagement type. Here you can go ahead and put post engagement. Here you can put the uh, performance goal as a maximize engagement with a post. This is the best one to choose. For the cost per result goal, here you have to let it empty for the Facebook to decide whatever uh, it is uh, suitable. Now we have the budget and scheduling. The daily budget, uh, you have to put a, um, a logical budget. I'm going to put, for example, in my uh, here currency 2000. Uh, it is in my currency, it is not $2000. Now for the schedule, I am going to put, for example, I can start a date and let a end date, or I will not set an end date. It is up to you. I am not going to put an end date for this campaign. Here are the budget scheduling. You can go ahead and try the budget scheduling, but I will not try it because I, I want to use only the classic method uh, for, from Facebook ads. Now the audience control. You can go ahead and put the audience. You can see the minimum age you can exclude some custom audiences it is up to you, you can go use also the advantage plus audience and it is highly recommended to use the advantage plus audience now for the placement it is up to you to choose the placement you can edit the placement or right here you can put manual placement as you can see here you can put for uh, Facebook and not Instagram or put only one of those. It is up to you to choose manually. After you have set everything right here, I'm going to click on next. This is where the fun part is going to be. Now for the ad name, I'm going to put it carousel also. Carousel. Like this. Partnership ad, I am not going to turn it on. The identity, you have to select the page, Facebook page and the Instagram account. The ad setup is right here. You are going to create a ad here. This is the ad. Now for the media, you can go ahead and put multiple images right here. I will let you see that. 
Now, if the menu doesn't show up right here, as you can see, add setup and here the manual upload and the format is not showing up uh, like this single image or video carousel or collection. All you have to do is to close up this uh, window of the campaign. Then you have to create a campaign that concern a lead like here i'm going to close this and i will let you see here you can use either leads or sales i will go back to my campaign right here i'm going to modify it and set up everything we have i'm going right here to put the carousel here we have a carousel i am going to click on carousel here then add at least two cards. I'm going to add a card. I'm going to add the cards that I have. I'm going to upload, for example, this to this and also this. Let's say that these, all of these are carousels or cards. I will let the uh, Facebook uh, process the uploading. Then I will be back when it finish. Now all my images are uploaded and ready to go. All you have to do is to select, uh, select the images that you have. It will be shown up right here. We are going to put eight images, click on continue and here we are good to go. Everything is in order here. We have doesn't have a destination. We are going to put the destination to the image here. I am going to put a website any website that you have for example i'm going to put google and here we go this is uh, a problem solved now we have the images i'm going to put the ad preview i will let here uh, no preview for this ad and everything will be good here we have the cards you can uh, uh, modify each one individually Right here, you can go ahead and modify each card individually. You can put uh, set the link for each card. You can put the headline for each card, the description for any card that you want individually. You can also add some cards. You can add a video card. You can add a card from a preview ads. It is up to you. The edit placement, you are going to put it for, for example, this is the uh, Instagram a feed here we can change or crop the image we can put a headline destination link you can put an alternative text it is up to you the primary text it is up to you to put uh, some text for example uh, outdoor like this deco i'm going to put this i can add another text option for example home Deco. This is a, a variation for the text. You can add a lot of text. Now for the main um, publication or the main post, it will be uh, having a call to action. I'm going to put it, for example, you can have uh, apply now, download, contact us. This is the most used one. And here the optional uh, here is to highlight your promo code. It is right here. You can put a promo code, for example, uh, like this. Uh, I'm going to put top uh, like this, top 50 off like this. And it will be good to go. This is the promo code. And here for uh, the advantage plus creative, you can tailor your ad um here for the um, viewers and you will be good to go you have some enhancement you can edit them right here and you will be good to go and now for the website you can go ahead and add the website uh, right here i have added google just for the sake of the video here you have to you can add a browser ads, uh, add add-ons and etc that was uh, uh, generally everything about the carousel. Here you can put the traffic and after you finish everything, you click simply on publish and you will be good to go. And here are uh, here is the carousel. As you can see here, this is the preview. Now the image number one, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight. That was all and that was everything. Thank you guys for watching and I hope to see you soon on the next one.